Hello and welcome friends. The chapter marginal coating, and we are going to discuss a problem which can be recognized as sensitivity analysis problem. The problem given is a farm has rupees ten lakh or one million invested in its plant and sets a goal of fifteen percent annual return on investment. Fixed cost in the factory presently amount to rupees four lakh per annum, and variable cost amount to rupees fifteen per unit produced. In the past year, the firm produced and sold fifty thousand units at the rate of rupees twenty five each, and earned a profit of rupees one lakh. That means one lakh is the actual profit earned during the last year by selling fifty thousand units at the rate of Rupees twenty five per unit. Then the variable cost is rupees fifteen and fixed cost amounts to rupees four lakh per annum. How can the management achieve their target profit goal by varying or changing different variables like fixed cost, variable costs, quantity sold, and increasing the price per unit? So, first of all, what is the exact matter? The company or the firm wants to earn the desired profit. What is the desired profit? Desired profit is ROI fifteen percent on investment. That means investment or fifteen percent on investment. That means fifteen percent of ten lakh or one million. So the desired profit comes to rupees one lakh fifty thousand, and the company has failed in earning the desired profit amounting to rupees one hundred fifty thousand during the last year. Whatever the reason may be, but now the company management is thinking that what can be done. There are various options. They can change various factors. Like fixed cost, they can they think that if we reduce the fixed cost and increase the profit, because total amount of contribution, when they are not in a position to increase the sales from fifty thousand units or selling price from twenty five rupees per unit, or say they cannot decrease the variable cost from rupees fifteen per unit, they can think about the decreasing fixed cost. But as we know that. Fixed cost or variable cost. The costs are determined by external forces or mainly influenced by external forces. So it is not an easy task to decrease any cost according to the desire of the management or owner of the firm. But that is one of the alternative by vacating some leasehold properties or fixed rent bearing properties, etc. They can try to decrease the fixed cost. Similarly, bargaining. Increasing the efficiency of labor force, that type of efforts can be taken to decrease the variable cost. So these types of options are not available. That is not the matter. Okay. Now, first of all, if they consider to decrease the fixed cost, we believe that all other factors remain constant. That means no change in variable cost, no change in selling price, no change in sales quantity. So what will happen? First of all, so far as the solution of this problem is concerned, we are going to solve the entire problem through only one formula. And as I have earlier said, that is my favorite one, the formula of sales or required sales. We are going to use only one formula to solve this entire problem, so that the students who refer to or who try to learn this solution through my video lectures. Can feel that the solution is actually very easy. Okay, so we are going to use this formula: sales equals to fixed cost plus profit divided by contribution per unit. Now, in this formula, we have to take profit of one lakh fifty thousand, the desired profit, not the actual profit. Because ultimately, all this sensitivity analysis for achieving the desired ROI or desired profit. So now, first of all, if 
we want to change or want to decrease the fixed cost what should be the revised fixed cost the main problem in the center at this time is what should be the revised fixed cost or why what amount the fixed cost should be decreased let us substitute the figures in the formula So ultimately the numerical equation is like this, cross multiplication, these are units, this is amount, so it will be 5 lakh, that means contribution should be rupees 5 lakh or contribution was rupees 5 lakh during the last year and in the next period also since there is no change in sales quantity, selling price and variable cost, the contribution is going to remain rupees 5 lakh. But now we want profit of rupees 1 lakh 50 thousand instead of rupees 1 lakh. So the revised fixed cost comes to rupees 3 lakh 50 thousand. So now we can say that if the company succeed in reducing the fixed cost to rupees 3 lakh 50 thousand from rupees 4 lakh, the profit can be rupees 1 lakh 50 thousand, that is 15 percent of the investment. So the firm should decrease the fixed cost by rupees 50,000. In this way other factors can be considered for the purpose of changing. So this is the first point of sensitivity analysis. In the next lecture or next coming three to four lectures we are going to discuss the change in all other factors. Thank you very much.